We have made it to the sand scramble. Hopefully my janky setup works, but it was raining the whole entire way here. As we get to the sand dunes and we can see the heavens have opened and the sun is shining. And Kinda. it is amazing. All right, we have made it out here to do the Red Bull race. Got the good old knobbies on here because they won't let us run paddles. Got this janky setup going on. We got duct tape, we got a cage that's not powder coated. We got a loud sand car. But here we go, we're gonna go to tech. <laughs> I'm out of weapons. <laughs> okay. I'll just be honest, it has zero weapons. Okay. But I do have plastics just transforming off of the car. Yeah, it's a yeah. long drive. Right. It's a solid two and a half hours. <laughs> you know? Yeah. That you'll never get back. Nope. Never. I'll never, never get, get back. back. Never get back. But yeah, you want my helmet, right? Yeah, right behind you. So, and I'm running a legit safety setup. Do you want to see my gloves too? No. I got them fireproof things. You guys wanted those, right? No. I mean, it, if you're only running, you're only running sports. Right? I don't have yeah. to run those. No, I mean you're lying. I mean, you can't. Do I have to wear that helmet with the collar? You do have to wear the helmet with the collar. Oh, okay. Sports. Do I have to wear the fire suit? No. I don't. Not for sports. Yes! I hate that suit, dude. I hate the suit. I'm so excited that I <laughs> just make your day right now? Yeah, I was really I was really bummed that I was doing sportsman. Now I'm not. You got the five point the fifth point down? Oh I do. It's solid. Alright. <laughs> right? That's probably better than Yeah, it is. It, it's, it's, it's good. Strong, you guys wanna see? That works. No. It's you're solid. Gonna, you're gonna pull somebody backwards there? Yeah. It's a toe strap slash. You wanna see a cage on this thing? We did put a cage on it because last year. I got DQ'd with my Pro R because it didn't have a cage. Ah. So I had a feeling the same thing was going to happen this year that I was going to get DQ'd because of the cage. Yeah. Well, so no, the last time I saw you in this car, you had the stock cage and have a suit. Yeah. I think it's is it a legend to have a suit? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. This cage got put on as of yesterday. And you thought you broke the rear dip or something. Yeah. yeah. That was, a, that was a rock. Yeah, that's all it was. It was good. Rocks, like, get, that's why I got those rock knockers. Big shout out to rock oh, knockers. I remember that. Rock knockers are saving our wheels. Yeah. yeah. Because it made me lose a race. Yep. I think that kid had me anyways. He had me on the whole shot. Yeah, I was there. Yeah. You know, zip tie the snot out of this to win, you know? You got your transponder, your transformer up there? Uh, transformer is right here. Uh, transponder is right here. I have, yeah, I have, I have You got a copy? We'll do a site map at 7.45, start racing at 8 o'clock. All right, we are ready for the Red Bull race. It is early in the morning. They're not looking too ready. Here's what. Got the transponder on. Got our little sticker. We're good to do the race. We'll see how today goes. I found out after BSing with a few people at the dinner last night, at the driver's meeting, uh, a lot of people have been here for a week, prepping, testing, running their knobbies. I showed up yesterday. We put paddles on because I hate knobbies out here unless I have to. So I'm running the knobbies because we have to for the Red Bull race, but we did one lap and I kind of have a vibe of it, but some guys did some research. They're taking this on to another level as if you're gonna win a car. I'm not taking it that seriously. So we'll see how we do today, but we'll do a slow lap on the first lap. I may get passed at the first lap because these guys got this studied. Like some of these guys last night, they're telling me like, yeah, if you take this one line to the right, you're gonna, it's a better line. I'm like, holy crap, like they have studied this thing. We should have done that and done a little less playing yesterday, but all good. We're gonna hair, we're gonna have fun. This is awesome. So I might be embarrassing on the first lap. Hopefully second lap, I got some speed. <laughs> First heat, sportsman class.
parts come together. Right here. That's out in front. He's out. Maverick cars coming in hot. Coming in hot. Here's the race right here. Yeah, let's go. Hey, we got another race going on right here. What is going to happen here? Oh, oh, oh. Mavar's out front. It's over. Unless that Mavar breaks, it's over. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to be. Oh, here they go. Here they go. Here they go. What's going on? What's going on right here? Woo! Wow! No way! No way! Holy crap! Okay, poor start. Poor start, but those, uh, Mavic cars just do not.
Get him, buddy. guys are taking this lane and some guys take this lane over here but you gotta check up a lot more this dude's boogieing I knows it over there on the left. Looks like Max slipped into second place. Kid is, uh, if this car holds together, it's gonna be a race. That's all I can say. Oh, shoot. <laughs> no way! Holy crap, you've gotta be kidding me. The kid is freaking wild, man. Oh my gosh. Dude, that bandit, they got it tuned, E85. Like, dude, it looks like a straight race car for pavement. It, oh yeah. Oh, it wasn't the Pro R I thought it was. It was a different guy. pulled out we don't know what's going on there hopefully we'll get an update but it looks like oh this dude is sending it We got race mom over here <laughs> taking care of us saying Dallin you better step it up son you know so first uh first heat man how did how to go not well I noticed a lot of Maverick cars are struggling we are a heavy car yeah knobbies you put us on paddles we got a lot a lot of power where that traction would be great but we are spinning, us Maverick cars. No traction. I don't think one Maverick car has came out of the whole well. Um, without paddles, <laughs> we're struggling. So we have dropped PSI a ton. I think six pounds. Um, got it a lot, lot, lot lower on the PSI. Just in the collars, just so I can not bottom out and go a little bit harder. So here we go. All right. On to the, we'll watch the LCQs go down and then we'll do the race. Hopefully I'm not too far back in the line. I'm mad. I, should have had the guy in front of me and didn't get him. Um, I should have gotten more aggressive. Yep, so we got... I just wanted to save my car. 
wasn't here to wreck it, so I should have gotten aggressive. Oh, I think you did good. Fourth place, Fourth first, is not first good. Red Bull race. Especially when, like, I know I had the guy. Like, yeah, that's what was frustrating. You had a you had a hard time getting around him. I just I just couldn't get around him. You know, and and watching you, you just didn't have the traction. Like you start, oh, no. you start getting on the gas in this car, and you just lose traction. So we're going for uh, stiffer strings in the front because these Mavars are just, you know, just tanking in the front. Well, we had this, you know, with MTS, we had Ned, and he had set it all up. Great, comfortable car. It does really well, ripping through the dunes, right? But the second you're trying to race and just plow through hills, you gotta you get a stiffer. little bit firmer. Yeah. So that's what we're doing. Yeah. We're gonna get rid of some of that plush comfort, but we're gonna be able to handle some of the mean hits. Your suspension was set up for duning. This is and a it, this it, Red Bull it race. Well. <laughs> yeah. This I is a different it. story. So, yeah. Lower PSI on the tires, giving it more surface area. Probably should have put more effort into this. Now that I'm like into it. I'm a little bummed that we didn't prep. I mean, we had guys prepping for a week out here. Um, I got guys out here, you know, a third a tank of fuel. I got mine brimmed. Oh yeah. Like. Yeah. That's a lot of weight. You know, probably should have gotten a little but, bit more. I should have cared a lot more about winning and prepping the car for the win versus like, dude, I just want to come out here, race. But have those fun. guys have like 800 pounds of powder coat on their cage. They do. I have zero. I saved on you that. You have zero. So, you got him, man.
this is what we saw. Ooh. Yeah. Following people into holes. I thought they had a good line picked out. And we just plowed into some holes. Sean would like to say that my car turned into a dozer because my skid plate folded back, as you can tell. Way and, in the then, road. and then all I did was just drag and push sand the whole entire race. Like cars that are slower than my car were catching me on the big straightaways I was losing. The side by sides that I should have been faster on the high speed stuff, like they were catching me. And so I had to do everything I could in the corners. Draw, car drove like crap because it was like pushing it and like dragging it down and I was like bottoming out even worse so it was a nightmare but car made it other than that skid plate <laughs>
since we did the track. Yeah, that was really nice of you to groom the trail with your. Uh, I just groom while I race. Your skid plate yeah. hanging down there. Yeah. It's a good thing that Can Am built such a quality machine. If we could just get a good skid plate. We didn't even know it had that feature. Yeah. All right, I'm not so, gonna lie. I followed a couple people into some witch's eyes. Could have been a little bit of bad driving. Not just Can Am there. Hey, but. Well, at least your car doesn't look like that. Dude, there was cars left. I'm just driving and then there's like a yellow flag and a car over here. There's a car. I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah. It was, it was out of control. All right, so you started out like 16th place. You're right in the middle. Kind of a grind because you're, you don't have a whole shot car, that's for sure. Don't have a whole shot car, but really I actually didn't do horrible on the whole shot compared to where I was sitting. Yeah, yeah. But the second I bottomed out hard and that did yeah. that, the skid plate. Yeah. I was struggling from then on out. And hey, what happened to you, man? Felt. That's Felt. what we figured. Yeah. Well, before that, somebody you were, ran into the back of me and flat my driver's rear. Oh, you were crushing it. So he's out, like, just crushing it, and then he disappeared. I don't know. I don't know and then we, there were cars left and right just everywhere. We didn't even see you. you we got lost in the mix. So I'm like, really? I'm like, dude, Dallin didn't make it out of that valley. And then we I followed like, someone into like this mean hole. Yeah. They took a horrible line and I followed them. Here, let's check out what happened. So you're you're going so fast that you you wore the paint off the page. That's amazing. That's how fast I was going. So this is what we saw. Ooh. Yeah. It was fun. The problem is, is we deflated my tires to nothing. Head shake like you wouldn't believe okay. with my tires deflated and then bottoming out like you wouldn't believe. Like everywhere I was bottoming out. Wow. Like I was having to check up hard and then my skid plates tore off and it was just, after that, it was just dragging me into the ground. Yeah. So the guys that we were standing with, they have a 62 year old friend who decided to race last night and he was beating you like the entire race and so we just happened to be standing next to them and we're like dude that's our guy, that's our all guy. we care is that our guy beats your guy yeah. that's all we care about and you ended up beating him yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> suck it whoever that guy was. you beat a 16 year old guy that's right old man yeah these queer <laughs> <laughs> that was good hey make some noise these are your sports <laughs> 2024 the iconic right. Davis Dunes, what a great backtrack. Yes, 2024 season, your winner, Corbin Leota. Make some noise, here's your one, two, and three in the pro class, Corbin Chase and Sean. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. If you go to our website, you can get a, dis a discount on MTS suspension. It did make a big difference. Uh, we did adjust for it, but if I didn't follow so many people into bad spots, I probably would not have destroyed my skin plate. Uh, but we did tinker with it and made it better for the race. If you like to support the channel, subscribe. All of our stuff is already discounted on our website. Just go down in the link below, click on the description, and hit that link where it says Desert SXS. Get yourself some stuff or some sweet merch. Thanks for tuning in and thanks for watching.